This video explains how to import a Mitsubishi GXWorks 2 project into GXWorks 3 in order to use your old projects with an IQF or IQR CPU from Mitsubishi. And this is how easy it goes. Once you got the GXWorks 3 open, you will find under the item project here another item which says open other format file and here you can see different file formats where you can open in this case we will go to the um, gxworks 2 and just select any file that is written with the gxworks 2 in formal times i got one right here and then i just go ahead and open it and here you will be asked on whether you need a bus module or not. And in this case we do not have a bus module, so we just continue with this selection right here. And now it's changing and converting all the files, including the special flags or special words. Okay, there you go. Now it has been changed and modified. Now we click OK. After that a rebuild needs to be done. And then we will have some faults occurring. And I can show you how to get rid of those faults or errors. All right, now this says a, a device which is latched has been assigned for variable global class. Please change to variable global retain. In order to get rid of these faults, you can either change them all manually or since we got a, a project which has already been working on the FX3, we can go to options right here under tools, options. And then there is an item that says convert basic settings. And in these settings there is a section where it says check the consistency of global labels. And this we will put to no. And um, if you read this right here, if you don't have a working program, it is not recommended to put it to no. Uh, if you have a working project like mine, I have this multiple used already with my FX3, respectively FX2. So if no is selected, metal letter might not correctly work, though it will not be a conversion error. Please use no only for existing programs whose operating operation has been checked. So in this case, yes, we can use the no because it was an operational program. So click OK, say yes, and then make another rebuild. Okay, now we got one more error that says local latch label area capacity of program is insufficient. Um, you can find this on, you, you need to change this in the CPU parameters, which you can either do if you double click on this message right here, or you go to parameter on the project tree and the CPU parameter. And then you got a section right here, which says memory device settings and the device label memory area setting, which is this one right here in the fold. Open the detail settings and increase the ledge area to two. Click OK. Check it and do not forget to apply. And then we make another rebuild. 
and you will see there will be no faults anymore everything will be converted correctly the system flex and the system words will also be converted from the fx to the uh, iqf so everything will be in order and operational regarding or, or yeah regarding that you have uh, operational program that you had an operational program before the upgrade to the fx5 that's already it i thank you very much i say goodbye and i would appreciate a thumbs up and a subscription on my channel thank you very much Bye-bye.